I am so entirely excited for this video and this experience, as you can probably tell by my demeanor, but Darius and I are going on a little isolated, quarantined getaway. We're going to a yurt. We are going to Savage River Lodge, which is in Frostburg, Maryland. We're going up for one night. I surprised Darius with this trip and a video back. I just feel like we've been so super duper stressed with work, school, and I just wanted to get away where there's no phones and really no service no work in the picture um, and I feel like he feels the same way and it's a good way to end off our summer and because of the current pandemic we can't go on many vacations and these are the only types of things we really can do to be in driving distance so it's been kind of cool to find things in Maryland that I would have probably never gone to if it weren't for this pandemic. Savage River Lodge is a glamping if you will resort. It has a bunch of hiking trails and stuff to do. They have cabins if you have a larger party and then they have yurts, which is essentially like giant luxury tents, which is what Darius and I are staying in. Never stayed in a yurt, super excited about that. Then they have like a restaurant literally on the little resort. You really don't even have to leave. And they've also been super great with customer service. They like personalize a lot of things for you. You can have like a masseuse be there, or flowers, whatever, the whole nine yards. For Darius and I, when we get into the yurt, there's a charcuterie board in there, and then I have like homemade popcorn and chips and salsa. Also have dinner reservations at 7.30 tonight. I'm bringing a bunch of board games and just like stuff to do to make it like themed camping. I think that's all I really wanted to say. Not looking forward to this drive. I'm so excited. It would not be a true vacation with Jocelyn if we didn't get a drink. Starbucks. I literally have to go to Starbucks or Dunkin' for every car ride. Otherwise, like it's just not gonna work. You can't not go. Anywho, Dunkin's refreshers low-key smack recently. Hi, can I have two medium strawberry refreshers, please? Don't you love when you like stop after a drive-through because like you're done driving, but then there's a car behind you and they're not done driving? I got Darius and I the strawberry refreshers. Definitely like copying Starbucks, like a cheaper version, but now we are fully equipped to go on this trip. We have finally arrived. Here is our humble abode. The big reveal. Oh! Darius, it's so cute! This is literally adorable. We got a charcuterie board. We're here, finally, in the middle of nowhere. There's like four other yurts near us. I have to pee so bad, and then I'll do a little yurt tour. So when you come in, this is our first look of what it kind of looks like. It's literally a giant circle. Over here on the right, you have a cute little kitchen table. There's like literal stones to hang your coat up. And then on here, there's maps of the hiking trails and the resort. Flashlight. Over here is like your little kitchen area. There is actually a fridge. They give you the option to pre-order stuff. So this is a little charcuterie board that was in here chips and salsa and this is some homemade popcorn but they have like stuff to make coffee so that's on your right side on the left side you have like your little sitting area that's a balcony it's pretty nice if it was a nice night i would just sit out here but you're surrounded by the woods a little fireplace which won't be needed in the summer this is the bed very clean closet and then this is the bathroom which i think is my favorite part very aesthetically pleasing so the sink they have like his and her robes and then a shower, so. It's kind of raining. I don't think we're gonna hit up the trails today, but they have an umbrella here for us. They're just in there FaceTiming everybody. We're about to snack on the charcuterie board and chips and salsa. Our dinner reservations are at 7.30, so we still have an hour. Let's snack. I've just been looking at these maps. These are the trails I think Darius and I are gonna do tomorrow. This is like the resort. So we're yurt number six right here. And for dinner, we have to get to here. So I think we'll probably drive. He's on the phone with his aunt. 
changed into a cuter outfit for dinner. But before that, I'm trying to get Darius to take pictures of me, I think right in front of the yurt. Hopefully they turn out cute. Darius, come take pictures of me. This is the fit. Air Forces. Oh, hey. Take pictures of me. Darius, stop. He will. Vibe this place. Here, we can eat outside. I don't know if we go in through here though. My sauce is pink. Darius is dumb. Basically, we got our bill and it was like three times the amount of what our bill was supposed to be and Darius almost freaking paid it. And then I'm like, we didn't order any of this stuff. Like it was a $65 bottle of freaking wine. We asked and of course we did get the wrong bill. So we almost paid three times the amount we were supposed to. And then we had to switch our card on file to Darius's card. So, you know, he could pay. But the lady's like, what's your billing address? And Darius sits like his zip code so confidently. And we're all just, I'm just like Darius. And she's looking at him like, hey, hey, hey. embarrassing. But anyways, dinner was super good. Going back to the room. We're just going to hang out, play some board games. Got this from Five and Below. Basically the knockoff version of Guess Who we're about to play. Babe, how do you feel about winning? I won. <laughs> Darius is the winner. Round one, he feels good. You feel good? On to round two. This is my round to win. It's best out of three. How do we? You don't get more than one question. What? Should I some weight? First one I have. No. Is yours match? I won. So I have one point, Darius has one point. So whoever wins the next game is the ultimate winner. I just have the update. I'm the winner. It is the next morning here. We got our little picnic basket with our daily muffin and orange juice. We're having a slow moving morning. Today we are going to check out at 11 and hit the trails around here. Maybe go to a restaurant, I don't know. It's all up in the air, but it was a really good night last night. Two nights here it would definitely be probably better I am going to get ready and shower and probably make myself coffee. So I'm about to take a shower, but this is something like, look at this. This is the little towel holder. I totally want this. I think it's so cute and it's movable. So when you take a shower, you just put it right there. This is quite embarrassing. I can't figure out how to make the coffee. Okay, I'm sure it does work. I'm sure I'm the idiot here, but we don't have coffee filters. They have these little instructions, but I can't find coffee filters. I don't know how to even turn this pot on. It looks like rise up coffee is not happening. Can't wait to hit the trails, babe. We should really utilize out here. Don't worry, there's no hunting. I prefer, I would have liked that yard. I feel like you get a better. You need to clean up and leave. 
There's Darius. See, I need to look at the map of all the trails to see what we're doing. I also got Darius and I matching little water bottles. We gotta go. We gotta clean up and get out of here. Whatever material the floor is with my shoes is making me slip. I feel like I'm skating right. I personally wanted to see water, but we did not take the right trail for that. It's okay. Kinda nice that we don't have to wear masks out here. Oh, I guess we go this way. It is so peaceful though. We're going up a hill. I think we're over the trails. Good thing I get to go to my coffee shop. I found a local coffee shop. I found a local coffee shop in Fallsburg and I wanna go there and I need my daily dose. Chris! Do you hear that echo? Woo! 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 We've made it to the end of this first trail and I think we're done for the day. Are you ready to be done? You're like running up the freaking mountain. The only thing about this place is that there's a 10 minute like one way road going steeply up a hill or down a hill to freaking get to it. Uh, we are leaving, about to go into the town of Frostburg and explore a bit, get some food and coffee. We're in the town of Frostburg. We're going to one of the recommended restaurants called Shogun. All right, I'm gonna end this here. I wanted to go to a cute little local coffee place, but they were all shut down because of Corona. So can't do that. So we're at Sheets getting gas and I'm gonna just get a coffee for the road. Yeah, that's my yurt trip. I'm ending this here. It was a very good resort. I would definitely come back and do a longer weekend.